y'all welcome back to my channel today I wanted to share with you guys my full laundry routine I do try to keep my laundry routine as simple as possible because let's face it who doesn't hate doing laundry I know I do so the simpler I can keep it the more likely I am to do the laundry to fold it and put it away so I like to keep it very simple um, and I do want to let you guys know that today's video is sponsored by EnviroCleanse you guys know I've worked with them in the past and I loved working with them and I love their products I would never share anything with you guys that I didn't love myself and I honestly truly mean that and I always want to be upfront and completely honest with you guys when I do do a sponsor video anything I make from that I put right back into my channel for you you guys to improve my quality so let's go ahead and jump right in so um, I tend to do laundry every day or at least try to do laundry every day that just helps keeps my load smaller <laughs> so it's easier and I will be more motivated to put it away if I let laundry pile up over time say I don't do it for like three or four days or I only do it once a week there will be so much laundry that I will wash I will dry it and then I just won't want to put it away <laughs> I'm just being honest with you guys laundry will sit in the basket on our floor and it won't get put away when the loads just get too big. So I try to do a load every single day. It doesn't always happen. Sometimes it doesn't need to be done every day or I just don't feel like it that day, but I do try. So um, how I break my laundry up is into colors, whites, towels, sheets, and blankets. And I do all of that for a reason, mainly because um, there are different weights, like towel is a heavier weight. You don't wanna wash that with your clothes, it could ruin your clothes, and you don't want colors to bleed with your whites or get your whites to get dingy. Um, for our dark clothes, I don't separate those by weight just because ain't nobody got time for that, honestly. I just like to throw them all in a basket. So for um, our colored clothes, I will just take jeans, t-shirts, whether they be uh, like a light blue or a dark black, I will just mix those all together. Um, and I will wash our colored clothes with these colored clothes. I used to do where I did her clothes separately, but when she turned about two, um, I switched her over to just doing everything on the same detergent and so I can do one load all together. For our clothes, I will typically use the Game Pods and the Snuggle Scent Boosters. I love the Snuggle Scent Boosters. You guys know I've talked about them a ton. Um, I think they're like $350, $380 or something at Walmart. They're super cheap and make your laundry smell amazing. And then the Gain right now, that's just what I'm using, but I do honestly switch out our laundry detergent a ton. The only thing I don't use is Tide because I will break out in hives. I'm allergic. <laughs> but I will use pretty much anything else. I will say I, I have enjoyed the 7th generation one. And there's one other method. The Method Laundry Detergent. I've enjoyed both of those in the past. Gain is just what I'm using for right now. So um, for those, I will do typically one, one load of those every day. I will usually wash on a heavy wash with a large load. Um, no extra rinse and I will wash them like that and then I will dry on like a medium high heat um, and then I will fold and put those away every night after work or um, during the day while Dee is taking a nap. Um, for towels, towels are a bit different. Um, I will either wash them like once a week or whatever however many times I need to wash towels. I will wait until I have like a medium or small size load throw those in and I will use the game pods with the Enviro Cleanse um, laundry enhancer and I've used both the liquid and the powder form I gotta say I prefer the powder form I'm just finding that um, I don't over pour with it because they give you a scoop um, and it's really easy to use I love Enviro Cleanse because they are very environmentally friendly they're also made from earth minerals and they're non-toxic to your family and your pets which is really nice when I'm using them on things that will be going on my daughter I'm always very health conscious about what she eats and what um, cleaners and detergents and things like that I use for her. I also really like that they use no masking agents in the laundry enhancer. It's actually removing the odor at the source so they're not throwing a bunch of perfume and fragrance on your laundry just to mask the smell from use. So I will use that anytime I wash my um, towels in the washing machine but if I actually want to strip my towels, I love to strip my towels once a month. I will be doing an upcoming monthly cleaning routine for you guys. Um, but once a month, I will take my towels. I will fill the bathtub with warm water. I will put my towels in there and I will sprinkle one scoop of the laundry enhancer on top. And I will let the towels soak from anywhere from 30 minutes to a couple hours. The longer, the better. Um, and that will actually strip all of the moldy, mildewy smell, dingy smell that towels sometimes get. I know my towels get like that. Um, it just like builds up over time 
And if you guys want to try this laundry enhancer out, um, I do have a discount code for you. It's just ROSE15. I will link that down below for you guys, and it will save you 15% on the laundry enhancer. Um, again, I highly recommend it. It gets the smells out of my towels so well. So definitely check that coupon code out because it will save you guys some money, which I'm always about. I always want to get coupon codes to help you guys save some money. So I will do that once a month. Um, and then after I let them soak for a while, I will wring them out and then I will go throw them in the washer with my normal laundry detergent, so the Game Pods and the Snuggle Scent Boosters. And I will wash those on hot with a heavy load. And I don't think I said this, but my color clothes, I always wash on cold. Any type of clothes we own, I always do on cold. So, but the towels I will do on hot and then I will just do a high heat dry and then I will fold and put those away. Um, the next thing I do are our whites. I'll gather all the whites in the house of our clothes, so R's and D's. I will put those in a washer. Um, we have a lot less whites than we do color clothes, so I will normally put this on a small load and it will be on cold. And I will use the Game Pods, the Snuggle Scent Boosters, and then I will also use bleach. Um, I love to bleach our whites just to keep them nice and fresh looking and very white. I find that if I don't use bleach that over time they'll get really dingy, so I like to use bleach on our whites. Um, after whites, I will do our sheets once a week, ours and D's. Um, I usually do them every Monday. I will wash our I will wash our sheets and then I will wash D's sheets just because D's are white and ours are tan and I don't want to dingy up her sheets. I will wash them on hot. I will add the laundry enhancer um, because we have dogs who crawl up on this bed and I want to get that dog smell out. And then um, I will wash those, dry them, and I will put those on both our beds once a week. And then I will do blankets. That's just like our comforters. And I will do our comforters every two weeks to once a month. I usually try to push it to a month just because it's not touching your body. So I don't feel like you need to wash it as often as you wash sheets. I am crazy about washing our sheets just because I just don't like dirty sheets. So, um, but our comforters, um, I will wash ours and I will use, if the dogs have been up here a lot, I will use the EnviroCleanse. Um, and I will wash it once with the EnviroCleanse laundry enhancer and then I will wash it again with bleach if there are any like muddy paw prints or anything like that just because our um, comforter is white. And then these I will just wash on hot with the um, Game Pods and the laundry enhancer. I feel like I use the laundry enhancer so much but I'm just like if there's any odors I want them out of my laundry. <laughs> so. And that's pretty much it for my laundry routine. Like I said, I try to keep it as simple as possible. Otherwise, I will not want to do it because I hate laundry. So, so I will do our color clothes and our clothes and sometimes towels um, every few days, every day, just depending on how much laundry we have. I will strip the towels once a month. I wash our sheets once a week and then I wash our comforters every two weeks to every month. And I try to, if I can, um, put the laundry away as soon as I pull it out of the dryer. I'm not a perfect person though, so it doesn't always get done, but I find the sooner I get it out of the dryer, the sooner I get it in the basket and the sooner I get it folded, I'm more likely to put it away and it won't sit in that laundry basket. Um, so that's everything for this laundry routine, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure and give it a big thumbs up as well as hit subscribe down below. I would absolutely love to have you here. Um, leave a comment down below letting me know what your laundry routine looks like and I'll see you guys back here very, very soon.